Hi everyone again, Kim Rubiato here. Um, I've just realised something I can't actually talk about. Yeah. Okay, so I've taught you about the law of attraction before, but it goes deeper than that. Are you ready? Basically, people wonder why if the law of attraction exists, bad things happen because they're not, they're not wanting bad stuff to happen. But, with the law of attraction, you've got to take in everything to account. Every thought, every doubt, every fear, everything. If your focus is more doubtful, negative and fearful, that's going to bring all the stuff you're doubting and all the negative stuff to you. Also, following up from my last video, if your thoughts are all over the place, the things that you want are going to come a lot slower because you're not actually focused on what you want. You're only focused on what you want, like it's 0.1%, but you're focused on billions of different things all at once and probably more on the doubtful and fearful and negative things more than what you want. Hence why you have to go through a load of hell first, because you're the one making it happen with your own brain and your own thought process <laughs> literally you could be thinking oh i really i really want to get famous right but if you're not focused on that specific thought a hundred percent it ain't coming yet you're going to be waiting for ages. Why? Because you're also thinking about what you've got to do. What if something goes wrong? What if this happens? What if this happens? Oh, this person I like. Oh, this person I really don't like. All that is all happening at once. Not to mention all the rest of your thoughts at the same time. Hence why you need to meditate, because if you are not meditating, your thoughts are going to be going, zooming around, everything, all at once, and everything that you want is on the other side of that. Everything you want is going to come when your focus is on it enough. So, another thing to focus on is making sure you have no addictions because, guess what, those addictions are also going to take us if you're focused. <laughs> and yeah, that's another reason why all those things aren't coming because you're focused on about 50 billion different things all at once and it's all not good. <coughs> Your positive thinking is probably like 5% out of 100%. So, what's going to happen in your life? There's going to be 95% of it coming at you as fast as you think it. Exaggeration, but you get my you get my drift. And it's all gonna be what you don't want. And this is why I did this extra video because if you want the law of attraction to work for you, you need to control your mind. If you don't control your mind, it's not gonna work for you gonna be reacting to all of the bad stuff in your head.
I want. It could be even the smallest negative thing ever, like, oh, there's a draft. Or, I've got to take the bins out. Or, someone's poorly. Or, all the stuff that's going about at the moment. The best thing to do is avoid all that stuff. Not like avoid it where you're denying it, but don't focus on it. The more you focus on it, the more it's going to enhance and the more bad stuff is going to come. Even if it's not like horrendously bad stuff, it's still not what you want, right? You want good things. You want good things to happen. You want to meet your twin flame. You want to go on holiday. You want to get a really nice house at some point or whatever you want. It's not going to come very quickly if your focus isn't there. And that is the best way I can explain that without boring everyone and confusing everyone to the point where they're like, eh? Anyway, thanks for watching. Stay tuned and toodle mofos. And yes, I know, my hair.